In this video, we'll look at whether NH4Cl, that's ammonium chloride, is an electrolyte or a non-electrolyte. The first thing we need to do is determine what type of compound we have here. So when you see this NH4 here, this is considered the ammonium ion. It's a good one to remember. The whole thing has a one plus ionic charge. Chlorine, that forms the chloride ion, that'll have a one minus ionic charge. So we have an ionic compound here. Even though these are all non-metals, we have this ammonium ion and the chloride ion. So that gives us ammonium chloride, and that'll look like this. We'd have this positive ammonium ion and the negative chloride ion, they're attracted. So we have an ionic compound. Now we need to determine, will it dissolve in water and dissociate into its ions? Because if it dissolves in water and it produces ions, we'll have an electrolyte, and that solution will conduct electricity. Let's take a look at a solubility table to figure that out. So on our solubility table here, we find the ammonium ion. It's right up top, NH4 plus, and then we want to look for the chloride ion, that Cl minus right there. We go over and down, and that S, that tells us that we have a soluble compound. It'll dissolve in water, it'll dissociate, it'll be a strong electrolyte. So NH4 plus Cl minus is a strong electrolyte. Because our ammonium chloride is a strong electrolyte, it will dissolve in water. It'll create those ions, that NH4 plus ion, the chloride ion Cl minus, and the solution will conduct electricity. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.